Hi there! This week I'm going to teach you how to make a circle skirt. You'll see it's the easiest thing ever. So we will need one meter and a half of knit fabric, uh, the waistband pattern, scissors, pins, measuring tape, thread, and tailor's chalk. The waistband pattern is your waist measurement divided by two minus one and a half centimeter, and I did it 12 centimeters wide. So place the pattern onto the fold of your fabric, pin it down and cut along the edge, leaving one centimeter for seam allowance or one centimeter and a half. As I said before, I leave one centimeter because that's fine for me. But if you feel more comfortable having a bit more, just to make sure, uh, then leave one and a half. Then we're gonna fold it in half, right sides together, and we are going to pin the edge and sew along that line. Uh, one centimeter away from the edge. Now, with that seam, you just fold it in half like so, having the right side of the fabric outside, of course. In here, I just pin it down a bit so that it doesn't roll up more funny and it's easier to work with. Put it aside and now we move on into the skirt. So you need to fold your fabric in half making your selvages match, so the edge of your fabric match and then we're going to fold it in half again so you end up with uh, four layers of fabric so now take the corner where you, you see the two folds you know and we are going to take the measurement of your waist it doesn't have to be entirely precise because we're working with knit fabric so it should be okay but try and still make it quite accurate now uh, I pin it down so that the four layers of fabric didn't move around and uh, just cut along the line you just draw you'll end up having a circle like this so apparently this circle is our waist now, we'll just um, decide how long you want the skirt to be and to make that step easier, I just took some thread and uh, I wrap it around my tailor's chalk, made a nice knot, very secure and then using that, uh, I could draw the big circle a bit easier than measuring every single time like so I just draw like little dots on it and then I would just um, go over it uh, with the tailor stroke to draw a nice border of a circle and again I pin the four layers uh, together so that when I'm cutting they don't move around you can also just put some weights on it, but I thought they was a bit better. And then just cut along the edge. Uh, you can leave two centimeters for seam allowance. As it's knit fabric, it won't fray. So if you don't feel like hemming, doing this the hemline, you don't have to. Now we are going to put the belt, the belt, the waistband, and the skirt together like so and uh, just I as usually I just pin four side you know four points and then uh, when I go on the machine I just stretch it a bit and sew these with a zigzag stitch like so the zigzag uh, just um, it's important to do it with the zigzag stitch so that your fabric is still elastic and now the last step is doing the hem line so what I did is I just folded in, um, in like one centimeter and then one more time. Here it's a bit smaller but you know just how you feel comfortable again as it's knit fabric you won't fray so you can also just leave it like that. And this, the, this is the end result. It's very cute, it's very easy to wear, you can combine it with different things. It's very flowy and nice and so yeah 
I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, subscribe to my channel, click on that thumbs up, and follow me on Twitter and Instagram. So, I see you next week. Bye!